Hello everyone, VJZ32 here, back again for another decade. This is the Gods of Norse, follow up to the Gods of Egypt from Damas Adhita on Kickstarter. Hopefully I pronounced that sort of, more or less, how it's supposed to be. He also uh, did the Eternal Rain decks in the past. And uh, you have three decks here, the Purple Royal, the Olive SA, and the... Odin's Trophy, which is a hollow foil deck. There's 2,200 each of the main ones in purple and green, and there is 1,300 of the limited edition black one, Odin's Trophy. Yeah, 1300. Uh, these two have uh, nice foils, double foils, gold and white on this one. And this one is uh, silver and white. A little bit of uh, letter pressing and bossing, says Gods of Norse. Playing cards, Divine Playing Card Company. And uh, Divine Playing Card Company on the one side, premium playing cards in the other. Uh, Gods of Norse on top, that copy on the bottom, and they are made in Taiwan by Taiwan Playing Card Company. There is the backs, it's the back design, custom numbered seals. You can see I got 1248 and 497 out of 2200. And this one, of course, same artwork, but it's holographic foil. There you go. <laughs> and it's 769 out of 1300. Um, the inside also has artwork. I'll try to show it to you in a bit. One thing I will say is this, the standard decks definitely have a more flimsy tuck case. This one is definitely a nice thicker stock. Uh, the the gold and silver one there, well, gold and silver hollow foil, gold trophy, is on a premium matte embossed tuck. And it does have a metallic gold and red on the cards, as you'll see, with hollow foiled backs. The, these two are just a matte stock, not the premium stock, with embossing and the hot foils in the inner foil. Forster decks are all about Norse mythology, and you'll see Thor's hammer and the world serpent. Here on the back designs, there's, there's a hammer, and you kind of see the world serpent. I know just a little bit about that stuff, maybe thanks to God of War, and actually, there's a sticker with the hammer that came with it, and I'm guessing that's Odin. And even this little sticker it says Dots of Norse. I like it. Uh, let's look at these decks though. There's the inside. Very, very cool. But again, it seems like I don't really care for the insides being designed like that because you're never going to fully experience what it is that they put into that. So it is what it is, I guess. The Jokers here, they feature Mimir, the uh, wisest man alive. Well, I don't know if he's actually still alive. <laughs> Probably not, but at that time, and it says Gods of North. Riffle Suffle Playing Card Company. And both the Jokers are identical. The backs on this one, pretty nice. Uh, there is the Ace of Spades with some runics on it. And there's that Odin's Raven, I guess. <laughs> or is that just a video game thing? Uh, nice custom numbers, number cards, pips. And then the court cards. Got some uh, artwork. 
I'm not really familiar with all of them, but this is Odin. Here's the Ace of Diamonds, almost a pink color for the Hearts and Diamonds. And, um, this Jack of Clubs, of course, is Loki. Ace of Clubs, and then King of Hearts here is four. The God of Thunder, of course. That's about all I know. So I get that one. This one's exactly the same, except it's green coloring. It has a back design. It's pretty nice. And I mean, everything is the same, just a slightly different color scheme. And then the, the main event. <laughs> and this one has goldish colors. I believe this the one has metallic inks. There's the back, the hollow foil. Again, put to buy Taiwan playing cards. And this one again, nice red and gold metallic inks. And the cards are printed on a uh, A luxury stock, which is supposed to be similar to a B stock. And I'd say that's pretty damn good. Look at that. That's pretty cool how that looks. Was to have the foiled number seals. Yeah, I like them. I'm gonna give these a solid A plus. They're very nice. They're good quality. The linen finish as well. Yeah, I got no complaints. A plus. That's the God of Norse. The gods of North today, and uh, we'll see you next time for more. Thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe.